Hello and welcome to Indian News. You are watching English Bulletin with me, Ratnakar. Union Minister of Micro, Small and Medium Enterprises and the Minister for Road Transport and Highway Nitin Gadkari has invited MSMEs to avail concession of debt finance to install rooftop solar for business efficiency. Rooftop solar, he said, offers an excellent value proposition to MSMEs by significantly bringing down cost of electricity consumption, which on an average is up to one-fifth of their operational cost. Addressing a program promoting awareness about rooftop solar among MSMEs, Gadkari said, I believe there is a strong business case for MSMEs to install RTS and achieve significant savings to achieve the cost competitions. I am confident that MSMEs will stand together in generating and consuming solar power using their rooftops. The program inaugurated virtually by the minister was here in the presence of B.B. Swain and other top officials of the Ministry of MSMEs. On the occasion of National Security Day on Thursday, Nakhul Municipal Corporation officials and employees organized a bicycle rally to create awareness. In the morning, Nagpur Smart and Sustainable City Development Corporation Limited CEO Bhuvaneshwari as Additional Commissioner Ram Joshi, Additional Commissioner Sanjay Nipani, along with all the officers and employees, staged a bicycle rally from Akashwani Chowk to the Corporation Headquarters. Deputy Commissioner Ravindra Bhilavi, Deputy Commissioner Solid Waste Management Dr. Pradeep Dasarwar, Assistant Medical Health Officer Dr. Narendra Bahirwar, Chief Fire Officer Rajendra Uchke, Nuisance Detection Squad Chief Veer Sintambe, Green Vigil Foundation's Kaustup Chatterjee, Vishnu Das Yadav, Mehul Kosurkar and all local fire department officials, staff and nuisance detection personnel participated in the awareness cycle rally. At this time, the CEO of NSS DCDCL, Bhuneshwari has said that as of today, there is a need for imparting awareness among public regarding safety. A large number of studies have been started in Nagpur through private institutions to prepare for the Maharashtra Public Service Commission examination. Municipal Commissioner Radhakrishnan B had issued order to start the study under the rules of COVID in order to check whether the rules are being followed while educating the children in the studies. Mayor Dayashankar Tiwari paid a surprise visit to the study of Akar Foundation at Reshim Bagh. Opposition leader Tanaji Vanwe, Women and Child Welfare Committee Chairperson Divya Durde were also present. During the lockdown, the 10th then commissioner closed all the schools in the city. The students admitted the mayor to start the study. A large number of students from Nagpur and nearby districts areas were competitive exams. As there are no facilities in the nearby village, they live and study in hostels in Nagpur. The news in detail. 170 new corona positive cases have been reported in the last 24 hours in Nagpur district, with eight deaths occurring on Thursday. The death toll due to coronavirus pandemic has reached to 4,365. The number of cured patients has reached the vicinity of 1,40,000, and most of these patients have recovered during home isolation and treatment. The cumulative tally of corona positive patients has reached to 1,53,882. 10,968 COVID-19 tests took place on Thursday. The district's recovery rate has reached over 91%. The ongoing vaccination drive is various part of the city aimed at vaccination of senior citizens and frontline workers is supposed to bring the number of cases down. The district the district administration has called upon citizens to help administration controlling the pandemic by adhering to preventive measures such as wearing masks and maintaining social distancing. Well, that's all from this bulletin. For more updates in and around the city, stay tuned with NBC News. Till then, Ratnaka says goodbye. Please take very good care of yourself. Keep watching NBC News. Sach dikhai, bina chupai.